Box Project Two Column Notes, Section 5. In this section, we're going to do a quick review on gluing up your box. First, clamp up your box without glue, like Photo 6 posted in the shop. Make sure you have a glue bottle and a wet rag. Once the instructor approves it, it's time to start gluing up. You're going to begin by gluing up the rabbit joints on your front and back piece. Do not glue the bottom in. The bottom is going to float in the four sides of your box. A small amount of glue spread with your glue spreaders at the end of your arms will do the trick here. Now begin by clamping your box up like photo 5. That's pressing the rabbit joints onto the two sides. and then having a long clamp go across the length of your project. These clamps turned on end will act as a little stand and make gluing up your top here in a little bit easier. Now it's time to glue up your top. Place glue on all four sides of your rabbit joint. Again, spreading with your fingers and making sure that you don't use too much. Place it down into the bottom five pieces of your box project and begin by clamping up one of the corners. Lightly snug up the clamp so that it holds the corner and the top in place. And your top, if it's not cut perfectly, might pivot. So you're going to center it and then clamp the other corner. This is going to pin your top in place. Now, clamp your other two corners. This is seven of your nine clamps. So your last two baby F clamps are going to be placed between the corners on the long sides of your box. Lightly tighten your clamps so that the glue squeezes into the wood straws. And voila! All that's left to do now is clean up the wet glue. Make sure you have your name written clearly on your box project and put it away to dry overnight. This concludes the short summary video of section 5 of your two column notes. Let's get in the shop so we can get back to building.